This kind of a bill is so far-reaching that it just has a, a wrenching effect on families. Uh, there are many families where there might be perhaps one parent uh, who might, have, might be in the country for 5, 10, 15, 20 years. Uh, a good law-abiding uh, person in terms of holding down a steady job, working to try to provide for a family, uh, and then uh, maybe from some chance encounter with the government. Uh, maybe uh, the person uh, witnessed a traffic accident and was going to be a good Samaritan to come and help and gets interviewed by a policeman or fireman. Uh, who knows what the uh, incident might be, but if that person is then uh, questioned about uh, uh, citizenship uh, by the government and then uh, turned over to the federal uh, agents or deported, uh, and maybe it's even a mis case of mistaken identity or something, but uh, if the person uh, is then uh, deported from the country, what's that going to do to the family that's, that's left behind? Uh, that might then create a single parent uh, household. Uh, or it could create, create a no parent household. Uh, and the children are American citizens. Uh, regardless of how people feel about that, that's the law of the land, that's the United States Constitution. Uh, and you know, asking the neighbor to watch the kids for the next 10 years, that, that's uh, really going beyond what uh, most neighbors uh, would be willing to take on in terms of responsibility. Uh, so, uh, you know, there may be situations where people have lived here for many, many years, in many cases of children. Uh, the United States is the only country they've ever known. Uh, they may speak English, they may have uh, some other, you know, limited language skills back, uh, you know, whatever the, their parents' origin might be, but those are people who uh, are ready to be productive members of our society, uh, and uh, those family units get ripped apart uh, because of this. And there really needs to be a, a comprehensive and a humane solution to the immigration issue. Uh, and that includes border security, uh, it includes dealing with the people who are here, uh, who have been working for years, they've been paying into Social Security, and they would never get any money out of that system. Uh, so uh, they've been paying income taxes, they've been paying sales taxes, uh, and uh, those families, uh, to have people uh, you know, ripped apart, uh, it really hurts the family unit, and that's not good for our society either. Our society is better if uh, we can encourage stable home family situations uh, for everybody in this country.